cast of La Traviata has come to Philadelphia from all over the country, some of whom live right here in the Delaware Valley, and many of them are performing their roles for the first time in their careers. Let's get to know the people behind the voices of La Traviata. I grew up in Louisiana. I was born in New Orleans and raised in Baton Rouge. So I was born in Cleveland, Ohio, and we moved all over. Um, and eventually I grew up in Alva, Oklahoma. And uh, I reluctantly became an opera singer uh, when I was 22-ish. My mom always had a really amazing voice naturally, and she went to school and got um, a degree in performance, in vocal performance, and um, we always sang together, we always grew up singing, uh, and my mother was a very beautiful traviata, and she actually sang it when she um, worked as a young professional for a few years, before she kind of gave up her career um, to teach music, because she had three little darling angel girls. My dad uh, was an opera singer, uh, in his day, and um, this was one of the roles that he liked to perform. Uh, it was, I mean, it's so commonly done. He had the opportunity to do it frequently, and uh, when I finally became uh, an opera student, he uh, warned me that this would be one of the uh, most common roles of my career. Um, so here's number one, Dad. Uh, so I grew up playing flute. That's what I wanted to do. Opera came into my life very late, but because of that, uh, I feel like I had a very fresh take on it. I had a, a technique that was very natural, a sound that was very just learned from a wonderful singer who was my mother, and um, I had always had joy in music. I never felt like music or singing was something I live and breathe and die by, and if I don't do this, I will have no other calling in life. I've never felt like that about singing. And I was gonna be a teacher and have a rock band and do other, I don't know, stuff. And, uh, and uh, I slowly got uh, sucked into uh, the operatic uh, world, um, despite my best efforts. <laughs> I was born and raised in Westchester, Pennsylvania, so I'm a, a local boy. Uh, I actually was a pianist first. Long story short, uh, I came to it a little late uh, but I started to study new, uh, voice when I was about 25. Um, I'm from Davenport, Iowa. I, uh, I grew up there with a large family and one, I'm the second of seven kids. I'd always been in the, the musicals and had a rock band in high school. Actually, I was watching Johnny Carson one night. I was a kid, but I was watching Johnny Carson one night and um, Kiri Takanawa was singing a role, or was singing a, an aria from La Rondine. And I stopped my tracks and I looked at the TV and I said, that's what I want to do. It was, it was amazing. The name of my high school rock band was Paragon. But we were great. We played all the local homecoming dances. <laughs> I love Philadelphia. I think Philadelphia is the most fun place I've been in a while. I love Philadelphia. Philadelphia is great. I feel like I'm in a city, but I can walk on the street. I don't have to feel like this person walking towards me is going to attack me or spit at me. I have lived here about almost 10 years, and uh, well, being in Philly, it's, it's accessible to New York, but it's not living in New York. I don't have the, the stress of living in New York. Without naming names or islands uh, that are heavily populated in this region, I prefer this, this one much more to that one. <laughs> I'm a bitch.